International Hummus Day, I'm going to be showing you how to make three manly hummuses. Hum, hum, hummuses? Hummus I? Hum, hummuses? Hummuses. Hummuses? That's too many S's, isn't it? Isn't it? The first hummus I'm going to show you how to make is a black pudding, cheddar, and caramelised onion. Hummuses. To make this hummuses, you need chickpeas, onions, rosemary, oregano, black pudding, cheddar cheese, green peppercorns, black sesame seeds, ham stock, and a bottle of beer. Make like two bottles of beer. The first step to making manly hummus is simmer your chickpeas in beer, ham stock, and herbs, herbs. Go for manly ones, rosemary is pretty manly. I know it's got a lady name, but rosemary goes with beef, and beef is the manliest of all animals. Beef's not an animal, is it? Beef is the manliest of all dead animals. The next step is to chop and caramelize your onions. For this, you will need a knife and onions. Next, you have to cook your black pudding. Um, black pudding. Crumble it up in your pan. You can use your hand, or you can use um, other other hands. Um, you need to fry this up until it's like really sort of crispy, and then put it to one side because you get you add that in at the end. Now you just need to blend your hummus. Um, so in a food processor, chuck a mug of chickpeas, your cheddar cheese, toasted black sesame seeds. I didn't say you needed to toast them, but you, 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 you do, so toast them. If you haven't toasted them, get, get the toaster out. The caramelised onions, Green peppercorns, some of them, a good a good sum amount, uh, a little bit of oil, and uh, a little drop of beer. And then find the lid for your food processor. Got it, got it. And then blend until hummus. So once your hummus is blended like this, it will look blended. Um, pop it in a bowl. Well, once you've logged it in a bowl, chuck in your black pudding and fold, fold it through. Oh, fold. And there, you, and there you have it. One manly black pudding, caramelised onion and cheddar hummus. I'll, go, I'll eat some. That's hummus. Hum hummus number two is a beetroot beetroot and hot mustard hummus with pickle and by pickle I mean like dill pickle gherkiny fellas um, there, there's like no cooking with this one apart from you have to toast sunflower seeds and caraway seeds if you want to make this delicious manly hummus you need sunflower seeds that's really not that manly is it sunflower seeds yeah sunflower man ugh, manly sunflower seeds dill pickle, chickpeas, hot habanero mustard, or just hot mustard, or just mustard. Mustard, you need mustard, all right? Beetroot and caraway seeds. To make the beetroot and hot mustard hummus, chuck in one cup, a mug of chickpeas, 
some pre-cooked beetroot, the, the seeds and stuff, caraway and the sunflower, quite a big glug of glug? Yeah, I'm sticking with that. Quite a big glug of hot mustard. Oh, 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 oh. Um, some oil. And some beer. Then pop the lid on and blitz the dickens out of it. And once it's blitzed, it's ready to serve. And it looks... I'm not going to lie to you, that is not the manliest colour. It's quite pink. But, you know, good, good manly pink. I bet it tastes manly. It's quite nice. I can feel the hairs on my chest growing. To finish this manly pink hummus, throw in chopped up pickles. And then enjoy. That is pretty manly. Pretty manly. And lastly, but definitely still hummus, we are making a spicy peanut hummus. To make this hummus, manly hummus, you will need peanut butter, a cup of chickpeas, uh, dried bird's eye chilli, dried Thai hot chilli, chilli oil, fresh bird's eye chilli and jalapenos. Now to make this, this delicious hummus, chuck out everything I just said into a blender. I would say about 30 hot Thai chilies. About the same of dried bird's eye chilli, three jalapenos, uh, four fresh bird's eye chilies, one cup of chickpeas, a good dollop of peanut butter. I'd go with two good dollops actually, proper, you know, dollop. A good glug of chilli oil. Oh, dried chilli flakes as well. Stick some of them in it if you've got them. I've got them. And then a good glug of beer. Like with all hummus, blitz it until it is hummus. 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 Like with any hot food, I find it's always best... Oh, I've, I've made it now, by the way. With any hot food, I find it's always best to... Taste it by having a nice big tablespoon to see if it's hot enough. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. I can really taste the peanut butter. Oh. 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 If, like me, on International Hummus Day, you're having a wild party, I'll probably put the the links for the recipes in the description. Thanks for watching.